excuse the hair, excuse the mess. Oh, we spent the night in our camper van and a good night's sleep we had too. I'm just going to get some the tea on. I'll just on this little party going on.
Can you see me? Alright, so I'm cooking. I'm cooking some meatballs and pasta. Look good, eh? We've been to Penzance today. No, we haven't. We've been to St Ives today. And that was um, lovely there. We had um, like a day going on for the RNLI, the lifeboats, the Coast Guard. And um, so it was really busy down there. And really hot. Okay, so the cooking's doing really well. I'm um, gonna have a cold one. Gotta have a cold one, haven't you? Tesco beer door. It's actually not that cold because it hasn't been in the fridge, but it's uh, it's good. It hits the spot nonetheless. I tell you what's weird about um, being in the camper van is that everyone looks and they think everyone thinks you're really cool. Um, I've had you know a lot of interest and that intention. I mean, it's not even my camper van, but obviously people don't know that they think it is, and you get a lot of a lot of interest. People obviously think I'm a bit of a dude, don't they? Yeah. There you go. If only they knew. <laughs> no, the, the thing about being in a camper van is that it's, you know, it gives a lot of interest to people. A lot of people are interested in them. And in Cornwall, it's like the coolest place to be with a camper van. So it's brilliant, you know. We're on day three. And I've got another five left. <laughs> 